Okay, today we're gonna see a um <clears throat> the Pixar Fisher Price drawing Palm Pilot toy thingy. It makes the Game Boy Color sound up sound, start up sound, <laughs> sound up sound, and then displays the Pixar logo and a hypnosis logo or something. I guess that it I guess that means like if it's in a store display it's supposed to hypnotize you into buying it or something. I don't know. Good marketing, but, um, I don't know. So, yeah, you may have seen commercials for this, um, and, uh, you can, like, do, like, all sorts of weird erase effects and, uh, do stamps, and also you can select a background to draw in, like the house or whatever, um, kind of Make it look like there's butterflies everywhere. Yeah. They need to rake their leaves. Yeah. You know what? I'll rake their leaves for them. And it's another erase effect again. Um. And so um. Yeah. It, this was the first, um, the original Pixar. They also released a model where basically it's the same thing, except it came, it had a little socket up here for inserting a warm light, and it also came with one, and it came also with a case to put it in, which was nice. And I think it was called a Pixar Plus or something. When they upgraded the Pixar Color, they also added a lit screen. So, and it's still used, um, this one takes four double A's, um, I don't know, the picture color, I think that one took four double A's, or was it six, I don't know, or, I don't know, or was it two, I don't know. I never had a picture color, this was the only picture I ever had, um, but, uh, I also got a cartridge like this thing um, had these cartridge things that you could get for it. This one being obviously action art. It actually makes a different sound upon power up if there's a cartridge in it. Uh, for some reason, I don't know if there's something wrong with my cartridge, it sounds horrible. It sounds like it's running out of battery power, but that's not the problem because it sounded just fine when I was using the when I was just using it by itself, so why would the battery suddenly run out when I put this in and then be fine when I went back to original picture mode? It's like a crappy animation where uh, Spongebob like uh, nets a jellyfish. I actually drew this myself. Excuse the crappy drawing. Um, like you actually like you actually draw every frame um, You'll notice I have two copies of every frame, simply due to the fact that the screen kind of has trouble keeping up with um, fast moving objects, and the frames actually advance pretty fast, so I need two of them because um, it actually seems to have trouble keeping up with uh, fast moving objects um, on the screen, so this game kind of crap thing has blown it up. What's going on here? Uh, I think I just bumped the cartridge against the monitor. Okay. Why is it showing that? What's going on here? No, it won't even recognize the cartridge. Can I break it? Gee. It's not what I expect from Fisher Price. Not that I play with their toys anymore, but well, um, I guess I am kind of playing with one of their toys right now. Okay, what's going on here? Wait, is it? No, it should say action art. What's going on here? Is it broken or something? It was working fine a second ago.
There's also some pre um pre rendered things. Um and uh that's a city like alternating through night and day or something. That's as you can see a thunderstorm takes a few seconds to load them. And then it starts doing it, and then it plays through the, like, once. W normally they just loop, at, they just loop, um, until either you do something or until the picture's automatic shutoff kicks in to save batteries. After, like, after, like, uh, about a minute or something, if you don't do anything, it'll turn itself off. Because, you know, little kids have a tendency to leave things on by mistake. This one looks like a New York uh, sign. Some of the music tracks I actually like on this thing. Um, this is actually pretty cool. Um, I'll let the track play through. It just plays the same thing over and over again until you do something. Okay. You know, I, I've shown you most of this stuff here, um, but I'll go this way. Now this, um, it's kind of odd to, yeah, it's like a scrolling farm background, but It kind of reminds me of those old Fisher Price uh, musical wind-up TVs or something like you know the ones that had the uh, the paper like the film roll or something. You wound them up and then they'd play a little tune and it would and it would spin around and the pictures would spin around or something. And there's also like another set of pre-rendered stuff. Oh. oh, I just messed it up again. Yeah. It's one thing about this, it's really sensitive if you like bump it to if it if it gets bumped around or dropped or something when there's a cartridge in. It'll get really screwed up. Okay. Alright, well, thanks. I'm getting a bit sick of that screen now. Just crash again. Oh, no. Ugh, I'm gonna knock it over again. Oh, yeah. Jurassic Park, this is the last one I'm gonna show you that the time is running out on this video. Alright, so, yeah. So, yeah, the picture, this version is long out of production because they had the picture plus and then the picture color, and now they have this other weird one that's like, you make, you can make slideshows or something in color, so basically it's like a drawing and this and color screen all infused into one unit or something like that, so yeah.